Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the seventh edition of Google for Media. Let me start with an update on the GNI Digital Growth Program. Since kicking off the first workshops on April 1st, Google and AMSI have registered more than 500 journalists from 182 news outlets for a series of training sessions in the business of digital media. Mentors from Kapanlagi Universe, Tempo Magazine, and Detik will help lead the workshops through August, and we hope to hear more about their stories at the next Google for Media later this year. Google is also proud to be sponsoring journalists from eight countries in the region to attend the Asian American Journalist Association's four-month program. Congratulations to Nana Rishki Susanti from Tempo Media Group and Betty Herlina from Binchang Prompuan for being accepted into their executive leadership program, which runs until this August. Now, back in April, on April 2nd, International Fact-Checking Day, we launched the GNI University Verification Campaign in Asia with workshops and activities to boost fact-checking knowledge. We're happy to report that 206 teams have signed up and attended a series of workshops back in May. This is another step in our effort to help our partners fight misinformation. Now, in search news, last year we launched a new What to Watch feature. With this feature, we wanted to ensure that our media partners' premium, legitimate content was being surfaced right at the top of Google search when users are looking for something to watch. We partnered with Video.com to demonstrate how users can find great movie titles just by typing Film Terbaru or Film Indonesia or Nonton Apa into the search bar. We'll discuss this feature and a range of other topics during a great discussion about how we're working with MTech to support a healthy and legitimate media ecosystem in Indonesia. We're also going to hear from three publishers who have gone through a six-month program sponsored by the Google Initiative to learn about monetization and ads optimization on their websites. The GNI Local News Foundry has been an inspirational program, and we're excited to have guests from Maluku and South Sumatra join us, along with one of the largest media associations in Indonesia, SMSI. This week also marks Safer with Google Week. We have a series of events this week, including today's Google for Media, that will be talking about Google's commitment to privacy and security. We'll talk about our views on privacy today, and tomorrow we'll explain how we're fighting misinformation and how to keep your family's data safe and secure online. Tune in to Safer with Google tomorrow right here at 10 a.m. on June 30th on the Google Indonesia channel. And one last bit of good news. We recently announced a call for submissions to join the Journalist Creator Program and Sustainability Lab for Newsroom programs on YouTube. Both are a part of an effort to nurture even more independent news content on YouTube. We're really excited to have received more than 100 submissions. That's more than any country in the region. We hope to announce those results very soon. Now, as you can see from the rundown, today's agenda is a packed one, so let's get started. Untuk membuka acara hari ini, mari kita sambut Sekretaris Jenderal Kementerian Komunikasi dan Informatika, Mbak Mira Taiba. Silakan, Mbak Mira. <tik> 